Hi, how are you? I probably can't hear the answer. Um, a lot of you do not know me. I do not know a lot of you. But on October 22nd at 8.30 p.m., I was going to take some pills and I left a Facebook message telling everybody I was gone or that, you know, telling everybody that I tried my best and I was just ready to end it all. I was ready to go. But for some reason, I could not get this song out of my head. I couldn't get it out of my brain. I could not stop thinking about Peter Parker. How he's always teetering on the edge of poverty, how he's always barely making ends meet, how he struggles to be the responsible, caring man while balancing a human life, a superhero life, the life of a best friend, the life of a lover. And I kept thinking, if he didn't give up, why in the fuck am I so ready to call it quits? This man has always had a chance to take the easy way out. Whether it be fighting a member of his rogue gallery and just turning off his spider sense for a minute and letting whatever happens, happen. Or putting on the symbiote suit and letting it do all the work for him. Or even letting it rob him of the lessons Uncle Ben instilled in him. Or even just deciding to give up the suit altogether. Retire from being Spider-Man. Go live a normal life. Let's be honest, there are other superheroes around. Why not let them carry the weight? He always had the chance to leave and nobody would have blamed him for it. Peter Parker's life is layered in tragedy, in loss, in grief, in heartbreak. But somehow, some way, he unabashedly keeps making jokes. He suffers, but he still makes others feel better. He uplifts himself while dealing with heartbreak. He has empathy when no one gives him any, and he deals with grief in smiles. It would be so easy for him to fall apart and stay crumbled and stay broken and stay lost, but he doesn't. He never does. He stands up for New York. He stands up for the people. He stands up for himself. Who am I to give up when this man, this myth, this marvel never did? So yeah, I ended up taking NyQuil, a lot of NyQuil, and and just going to sleep. And it's only been two days, guys, but I gotta tell you, the guilt, the grief, and the pain that I've been overcome with by what I almost did is heavy. It's very, very heavy. But I mean, it, it's only been two days. Who knows? I might heal. I might heal so well that it just does not hurt to talk about anymore. I'm glad I talked about it now. A lot of people are rooting for me, so they gotta see something I don't yet. They have to see something that I'm not noticing. But I know I have a power somewhere. And I'm like, oh, fuck it, just, just roll the clip, just roll the clip. 